It's Haley LeBlanc. And it's Jules LeBlanc. And we're with PETA to learn more about why you should skip SeaWorld this summer. All these animals live in concrete, barren enclosures. Can you imagine living your life in a pool, basically? No, that would be so torture. Terrible. They're clearly depressed and frustrated. SeaWorld's response is to give them psychoactive drugs. To Wait, did you know that? No, I had no, no idea. idea. They're trying to drug them? They are drugging them so they won't lash out. It's understandable that they're lashing out. Right. Animals including dolphins and whales are bred by SeaWorld. Again, some of them are drugged so they can't struggle. Right. And then they're forcibly impregnated by SeaWorld employees. Oh my. In some cases, they're shipped around the country. What would it be like if we were separated from our families? Heartbreaking. Yeah. I would never want that to happen. Mm -hmm. It's torture. A female orca can live up to 80 years old. At SeaWorld, orcas very often don't even make it into their teens. And they frequently die from unnatural causes like bacterial infections or a fractured skull. And there's no laws against this? It seems like there should be. Well, they're hiding it. There should be. Has SeaWorld what? ever had a response to this? SeaWorld, when they get questions, they like to talk about conservation and they talk about putting money into conservation. Well, the truth is that in 2021, they put 0.1% mm -hmm. of their profits into mm -hmm. conservation. I can't believe that I didn't know. Because Do you know how many people wouldn't go knowing this information? And that's why we need to spread the right. Awareness because exactly. how did we not know? When you went as kids, you had yeah. no, no idea. No, not at all. Kids would run kicking and screaming out of SeaWorld oh, if yeah. they knew what was yeah. going on. They would leave immediately. immediately. People just need to be cognizant and aware of what's going on rather than just you know, doing whatever they want and just having fun and not really caring who it harms. And you know, it's not just the orcas and dolphins. Sea lions, seals, walruses, they very often will go prematurely blind because they're forced to stare up into the sun because they have to beg for food. What are we gonna do? <laughs> we have to yeah. do something right now. And this is just for everyone's entertainment. And, money. and that's what it comes down to. Entertainment, it's money. money. It's exactly. Money. It's money. They're being treated like things like and objects, precisely like nothing, like garbage. Just speaking of SeaWorld treating animals like objects, SeaWorld actually shipped penguins from California to Michigan via FedEx in a plastic crate. Can you imagine? How that? can they get away um, with that? Right, like ordering a pair of shoes or something. Like the animals are objects. Right. I'm literally sitting here like yeah. waiting to get off this chair to go and do something. Is there anything we can do? The biggest and simplest thing that everyone can do is not to go. There's so many uh, other There's so ways many other that things. you can enjoy animals rather yeah. than see them in right. a swimming pool. I hope knowing this information, they would never step foot in a SeaWorld ever again. Yeah, like ask your favorite people to stop going yeah. and drop them. Right? Everybody needs to know. Yeah, mm -hmm. stop working with them, stop doing concerts yeah, there. Do. Yeah. Just no, no contact. <laughs> no contact. <laughs> Just don't go. Yeah. Ghost Please. them. Right? <laughs> go SeaWorld. Yeah, go SeaWorld summer. Start a hashtag. <laughs> if you're looking for ways to help, text OCEAN to 30933 to take actions for dolphins and orcas who suffer at SeaWorld.